I'm Christopher Zweig in Sawyer's Island, Maine, and today on CJ at the Movies, I'll be dishing on the new Artisan Liam Neeson movie called Made in Italy. Now, keep in mind, it's online already, but I managed to see it in theaters in Portland, Maine. Let's take a look. It tells the story of an estranged father-son relationship with Liam Neeson as an artist and Michelle Richardson as his soon-to-be-divorced son, both of whom travel from London to Tuscany, Italy to sell their old summer home, which is now a dump. Tuscany is a romantic idyll. It's why all my clients come here. You have delivered me a building site whose walls seem to have been painted by Mussolini. That's Lindsay Duncan as the real estate agent, and the jokes are run-of-the-mill with wet paint and broken doors, but the funniest is when they have to deal with an unwanted guest in the john. I wouldn't go on the bus if I were you. There's a large weasel in the sink. That's not a euphemism. Okay, what's the plan? Very late. It's like it's a big. rat boat, like... It's good teeth. The size of a baguette, like a rat baguette. There's also a subplot that's so underdeveloped involving a beautiful Italian restaurant owner played by Valeria Bilello, but at least the father-son relationship has some touching moments. Why are you selling it? Jack's memories of the house are not so good. I heard about your mother, Jack. I'm sorry. I don't remember anything. You can't remember her, and I can't forget. Neeson and Richardson both give fine performances, but Made in Italy never really worked for me. It seemed to rely on those obligatory broken house jokes and formula writing. It's also the directorial debut of actor James D'Arcy, who does an effective job with the leads but never seems to take any risks. If he wants to direct more films, he must step outside his comfort zone. For now, the movie is a mixed bag for me, so skip it. Well, that was my mixed review for Made in Italy. If you like this review and other reviews coming up, please subscribe to my channels. And you can also read my written material at cjatthemovies.com. I'm Christopher Zweig in Sawyer's Island, Maine, and I'll see you at the movies whenever we get back there.